everyone and welcome to a brand new video of yours truly, Benji the Beagle. So, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about five tips that can help you prepare for your very first furry convention. Let's get into it. Yes! In at number one now is go for the smaller conventions first. Um, Tales of Tornadoes is actually a good example of a small con for your if you're just getting into furry cons and don't know much about them. Uh, there's a lot of good smaller cons out there that actually could be like less stressful and overwhelming for those that are just getting started in the furry fandom. Uh, for us, for me, uh, the Dumbo I am, <laughs> I went to MFF for my very first furry convention in 2018. It was a lot of fun, although it was a little overwhelming for my first con. But for those who are more introverted and are definitely want something less overwhelming, I definitely recommend smaller conventions for their very first con for sure. Yes. And at number two now is you always want to go with friends or people you know to a furry convention. If you're just going by yourself, <laughs> it's it might not go as well as you want it to. I actually learned this the hard way at one convention one year and it wasn't a great time. I hate to say it. <laughs> it was the convention did an amazing job, but I just it wasn't good for me because there was like nobody I knew there. And it just yeah, you want to always go with friends. You want to go with people you know, saying hang out with your friends and have a good time. That's basically what conventions are about. Hang with friends, goofing off, and having fun. Yes. And at number three now, is you don't need a fursuit to go to a furry con. Even your first one, especially your first one. I know I mentioned this a lot, but you don't need a fursuit to be involved in the furry fandom. Just have fun. Be yourself. Be your goofy self and have fun at furry conventions. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. And at number four now, and that is the six two one rule. That is six showers. Wait, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> and at number four now is the six two one rule. This is actually a really important rule when going to furry cons, and also a really obvious one too. And that is six hours of sleep. Um, two meals and one shower. I know some people like to go more than that, like let's say 10 hours of sleep or uh, let's say three meals and um, maybe two showers. Um, yeah, but that's perfectly fine just as long as you stay within those those guidelines. I mean, it's yeah, it, it's, it's, it's pretty common sense in general to do that. <laughs> but yes, 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 yes. And now on to the fifth, 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 fifth and final tip for going to your very first furry convention. And that is, and this one should be really obvious, and that is just be kind to others. Be kind, caring, help others who need it when you're at a furry con. That should be like the most plain obvious one, uh, in my opinion. But yes, it's really, it's really awesome. Just be obvious, be kind, talk to people, be kind, caring. Yes. I hope you all enjoyed this. Again, if you have other tips that I did not mention in the video, leave them in the comments down below. I, again, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, give this a like, subscribe, turn on notifications, bonus for always. And as for always, I'm Benjiel Agur. Farewell.